Welcome into the 901. I'm Clayton Collier. Well, Memphis basketball teams and referees have had better nights together. Let's start with the Grizzlies. They were at OKC second quarter. John Morant was talking to a fan of his who was cheering him on tonight, and that got him ejected. Morant reportedly complained to the fan about not getting calls from the ref. The Jaw superfan was beside herself. Just a bizarre ejection. Grizzlies fell to the Thunder tonight, 116-109. But this was the best part. After he was ejected, his father, T. Morant, at the game today, brought Ja over to the fan on FaceTime to reassure her the incident was not her fault. This is why the guy is in line to get a shoe deal. He always brings the entertainment, even when he's kicked out of the game. Join us on Christmas Day, Christmas Day for a five-game slate of NBA action, including the main event here in Memphis. That's Grizzlies Warriors at 7 p.m. Coverage begins at 10 a.m. with a special edition of 901 Sports XL. On a more positive note, the Memphis Tigers defeated Texas A&M at FedEx Forum tonight, improving to 9-3 on the season. This despite seven Tigers having at least two fouls in the first half. They had 27 fouls called on them, three fouled out. Just a crazy finish, but hey, they got the job done. Well, the Minnesota Vikings weren't the only team staging a big comeback today. Memphis women's basketball rallied from a 15-point third-quarter deficit to get the win over St. Louis 83-71. A 28-point swing in the second half. How about that? Also, Madison Griggs finishing with 19 points, tying the program's all-time record for three-pointers. Congrats to her. Hey, with your 901, I'm Clayton Collier.